Here we are at the good old Brookhaven Stables. Today, we're going to be looking at how to get the Energy Crystal Pyramid. Yeah, that glowing pyramid that you probably see a few people have when you're in a lobby and you're like, huh? How did you get that? That pyramid is very essential for all the crazy secrets in all of Brookhaven, and it reveals a lot. So that's why I wanted to be a video on how to get it, the locations of where to obtain it, and uh, just give you guys a full rundown and explanation behind it so it can maybe help you in your journey of revealing all those Brookhaven secrets. It's like, it gets kind of crazy, I'm not going to lie. So subscribe and post some gifts for the ball, make it a go ting. Why are we at the stables today, waiting patiently on a Monday at 3 p.m. in Brookhaven? Well, we are waiting for doves to appear. Doves, just like the crow, whenever they appear, they have something special to give you. And boy, do they give you something special. The crow, it drops a little key card that you can dig up. But the doves, these little lovebirds, they grant you with an amazing source of energy. A crystal unlike any other. We're not talking about the crystals that you find scattered throughout the map. This is a crystal pyramid that harnesses power unlike any other that is essential to reveal the secrets behind Marcus and the agency and Mr. Brookhaven himself. This is huge. So this is one of the locations that sometimes, guys, sometimes it will spawn. The, the pyramid with the doves. Now the doves usually at this specific location, they spawn right here on this fence. And then they the pyramid spawns right here in a corner. You can barely see it. And you gotta be quick. Here's why. These doves only usually spawn around 10 seconds or so, it feels like. I haven't actually counted uh, counted it, but I'm pretty sure it's only like 10 to 15 seconds, if that. <laughs> because they, it's set up in such an intricate, difficult way that, honestly, I don't know. <laughs> Dude, I'll, I'll tell you. Okay, so basically say I was at the fire station right now, and the doves spawned, and somebody was like, hey, the doves just spawned. And then I'm making my way over to the fire and boom, despawned already, dude, that quick. And this makes it incredibly difficult because the, the, the areas of the map that they spawn in are so far from each other. So if you or your friends like, hey, the doves in the pyramid spawned over here, by the time your friend gets there, you're not going to be able to get it. But here's what me, Creek, and Poke did as we were dub watching for like hours, dude. I'm going to tell you guys why you don't have to wait hours like we did. Um, it's embarrassing, but... Basically, what we did was we had people post up at certain locations that we know the dove spawn. So if you're in a lobby by yourself, this is going to be difficult, not going to lie. And I am in a lobby by myself, so <laughs> it's a problem. Uh, anyway, so one of the locations, of course, is at the stable. So we had someone at the stables, which was me. Then we had someone at the town hall, which was Creek. And then I think we had someone at the cabin, which was also Poke. But, and we had other people as well at different locations, like the, the mall and everything. So that all helps. So basically, if you're in a lobby with friends, you really want this energy crystal pyramid, post up at those locations that I just stated. Now, I'm going to be going over how and where... Uh, these locations are as well, but uh, look as you guys can tell it's not spawning and it's totally randomized by the way But as I was just mentioning earlier how we caught ourselves waiting for hours on these doves to spawn There is a way to forcefully make them spawn sometimes now in order to do that If you're not getting no doves in your lobby and it just looks like a complete dead end Then what you can do is go to the church and ring the bell now, this kind of makes sense, doesn't it? But if you ring the bell, sometimes it will force a dove to start spawning or the doves to start spawning again, and that will give you another opportunity to get that energy crystal pyramid that you're looking for. Now, keep in mind where the doves are, it's very, very hard to see them sometimes, but they do make a noise. You can hear them just like you can hear the crow. So do keep that in mind. Uh, but whenever these pyramids spawn, guys, they're very hard to see and you can easily miss them. Okay, so like this location, for example, it spawns in this little corner here, and you can easily miss that. So do keep that in mind. What I want to do right now is I want to show you a clip from one of my live streams on where we found the Energy Crystal Pyramid right here at the stables when I just started a lobby. We just started a fresh stream. We were ready to go and get these secrets rolling, and this is where we first got the pyramid. Okay, so check this out. Dude, they don't spawn long enough. And then the crazy thing is, dude, if you sit there and wait, what, the dub was right there, dude. I, I can't even. If you sit there and wait, they won't spawn, dude. Oh my god, man. These stupid dubs, bro. I got it. Woo! All right, we got it, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> Woo! All right, we got this thing, dude. Now we're on next level stuff right there. Game ain't all right, man. All right, let's go ahead and um. As you can tell, it was very difficult. I almost even missed it, even though I was right next to it. Thankfully, one of you guys were in the lobby, and you were like, get it here, get it right now. And I was like, oh my god. I was like scrambling just to get over there. 
and get it. But as you can tell, we succeeded. Now, this was right when I started the lobby. I know a lot of people might be like, don't you got to activate this secret or maybe that secret in order to get this to work? I don't think there's nothing wrong with activating, like uh, getting the key card, activating TS level one. I think the dubs are still going to spawn. I think my buddy Darza said he had just started a server in a lobby and he got the dubs to spawn instantly as well. So I don't think that's the case. I just think it's very randomized and kind of scattered in different orders. I don't really know the exact scripting behind it, but it is difficult. So let's get to looking at some of these locations and maybe as we're looking through these locations, we can get lucky. I doubt it, but anyway, so these things are annoying. <laughs> Anyways, I told you guys this location, you've seen it on the video, the, the little love birds, dude. So let's go ahead and hop on our bike now. Now we're gonna go take a straight shot and go through the town on the locations that I currently know. There are probably more. If you know more locations, please share them with everyone. Now, another one I think is around this tree. Uh, and the dove spawn like around the town hall. I don't know the exact location I think this was the one that creek got pretty easily so that might be something to kind of take note on it's around there somewhere um, Next one is at the mall uh, The doves will spawn right at the corner of the top of the mall now the crystal I don't actually know where spawns uh, when they like I think the dove spawn on top I don't know if the crystal is up top or if it's just round or in it I don't know we're still searching and trying to find those but the cabin one, I can tell you guys, because I have seen that one as well uh, first up. So let's go ahead and head to the cabin. Now, keep in mind, there could be other locations, and I would love if you guys knew these other locations to post them in the comment section below for other people to acknowledge. Uh, that way, they can get closer to finding this pyramid as well. Now, what does this do for in terms of secrets? Well, I think whenever you get this energy crystal pyramid, you can take it to the top of the attic in one of these houses, um, one of the uh, houses that uh, have also that pyramid and you could reveal a secret code known as Marcus so uh, that's super interesting too right so now on this one the doves will spawn in this corner over here and then right over here right behind this tree will be the crystal pyramid there so do keep that in mind keep that in mind there so yep yep now me personally uh, I have a hard time finding them at other locations, so I just stick to the stables usually. Like, I'll join in a lobby and just wait around at the stables. Uh, and they usually do end up spawning there eventually. Uh, kind of like how, how I was at the start of this video. I just kind of sit there because that's the one that I'm comfortable with. That's the one that I know that I can get to and click as quickly as possible. Um, so you guys might find, like, the cabin might be good for you. I mean, it really all is depending on preference, right? But this is also extremely randomized and... Difficult, dude. Very, very difficult. So, uh, yeah, we could go try to ring the bell and see if that grants us with a summoning of these dubs at 9 p.m. I don't know. Um, but even if it did instantly summon them, I wouldn't be able to get to one of the locations in time. It's just kind of set up like that. I hate it, but it's true. Um, all right, so let's go ahead. And like I said, they only have like a 10, 15 second spawn radius, guys. So um, we'll pull that. Make sure you're listening because they are extremely loud and you can hear them okay I thought I see is that a dove that's the doves there's the pyramid it worked go for the pyramid first got it look at this thing look at this thing guys look at them love birds the love birds there they are we found you Oh, we found you. I cannot believe it, dude. We did it in this video. Boom. And there you have it, dude. There you have it. The pyramid in all of its glory right there for the taking. That's how you do it, guys. I'm taking some screenshots for the thumbnail. But yeah, that's how you do it. I cannot believe we got that to work. <laughs> dude, I cannot believe we got that to work. But that's perfect for explanation. Sometimes if you ring the bell, they will forcefully spawn in a location. So keep that in mind if you're having a difficulty finding them. It works, dude. I don't know. I'm still learning these secrets as I go as well, guys. We're chipping away at it slowly but surely. But boy, was that amazing to be able to get on video for this tutorial. So with that aside, we did it. <laughs> we got our pyramid. We can now get further to this. Also, I need to show you guys the house I was talking about. All right. So if we go here, um, I don't know if I remember the house. It's in one of the attics of these houses here. Because um, it's one that has the crystal. And then there's the one that also has the secret. So... Give me a second. I think it's actually this one. No. Okay, let's do that one. It could be wrong. I'm pretty bad at uh, telling the detailing on these houses. For me, I, I know this is going to sound weird, but almost all the Brookhaven houses look the same, dude, to me. I don't know why. <laughs> all right, this is right, though. Um, Let's go up here, and then you will see this pyramid here. If we go up, we can click it, and it says Marcus. So, yeah, dude, it's kind of crazy. I'm glad I got to do a video on this secret for you guys so you guys know where to go, how to get it, 
Um, and that's just how to do it, dude. We got more videos coming out all throughout the week, dude. This update is insane. I want to show you guys as much as I can and give you guys a full rundown on it as much as I can. But it is nutty. So, with that aside, love you guys. We'll see you all in the next one. If you made it to the end, comment below saying, hey, I made it. And I'm going to love you forever. All right. <laughs>